Hey, Yashir, here are 13 ways where you can pay and advertise your products. Way number one, it's on Google Ads, that is Google Search. If you want to be at the top of the list on Google, you can definitely pay, advertise and get on the top of the list. Number two is Google Shopping Ads. This is especially important if you sell a physical product or any kind of product, much more than service, much more than something that is intangible. You can be at the, I'm sure you know, like if you look up for something, even a book, let's say Can't Hurt Me by David Goggins, you search for it on Google and you'll see some shopping suggestions right below the search bar. That are Google shopping ads. That's number two where you can advertise to immediately be at the top of the list. Number three is Google display ads. So Google provides ads on various other platforms and other sites as well. You'll see on, on a lot of places, even like where you go and read news, you'll see like a banner pop up, an ad pop up. And that is provided by Google. These are Google ads. These are Google display ads. And you can, you can put them up and pay for them and get your product in front of more and more audience. Number four is on YouTube. YouTube is an amazing place to put up your products and your services. YouTube has got a very high audience retention. You know, uh, I, if I read it, if I remember it correctly, I had read it that YouTube on an average, a person spends 33 minutes once he looks up, once he hooks up on YouTube. So on YouTube, you've got an amazing audience retention. So that way, you know, it's a great place to capture your audience. YouTube ads could be a little expensive, but they are definitely worth the money because you have got the audience over there who are retained on the content over there. The next place, place number five is LinkedIn. LinkedIn has started its own promotional platform, the ad platform. Uh, to be very honest with you, I have not heard great reviews about it. As a matter of fact, I have heard from people that it is not really worth investing in ads on LinkedIn but it could definitely be an avenue for you to check out and maybe to look up. Another option, option number six, is on TikTok and Snapchat. In India, TikTok is not available, but you can definitely look up if you are out of India, if you're in the US, and you can check out advertising on TikTok and on Snapchat. Number seven. Number seven is one of the most common ones. It's Facebook ads. You can see Facebook has different ways of, of giving you ads at different places on the feed, in between videos, at the start of the video, and things like that. Check out Facebook ads. It is one of the most successful ad platforms that have ever been created. Though it's getting expensive every single day, every single moment, it is still one of the most successful ad platforms. And also the recent changes in the iOS 14 and the iOS 15, 16 thing, the new privacy changes on the Apple devices, that is going to completely change the game because Apple is coming up with a new ad platform. Let's go to the next one. The next one is number nine or number eight, whatever it is, it is Instagram. Instagram, you can see there are like different places you can put the ad. They have recently started ads in Reels. Reels are the big thing on Instagram right now. And they, you, they've already started putting ads in Reels. And that is amazing. If you've got a product, if you have got a service which you can talk about and grab attention in three to five seconds, Real Ads is the place to go. It is going to be a killer thing which is going to explode your business. Here we go. The next one is number... Number nine. Influencers. So there are influencers in every platform, wherever you go. There are people who have got a massive audience and all you have to reach is audience. Your idea behind marketing is reaching an audience and influencers are the ones where you can pay an X amount and get some money to them and they'll talk about your product, they'll showcase it and they will even advertise for you. Influencers is a great place to be at. They'll definitely help you reach more people. Number 10 is affiliates. Affiliates works kind of similar to influencers, but it works on commission basis. So let's say I, me and you work together and you say, yes, you're gonna advertise this product for me. And then I, I will give my audience a coupon code, let's say yes 10. And whenever they buy that product from you with the coupon code, which I have given, you come to know there's someone from me who has just bought because of me that is using my code YASH10, they have got a discount. You come to know there's a sale done because of me and then you give me a fixed amount of commission 
based on the number of sales that happen because of me. That is how affiliates usually work. Next is number 11, which is going a little old school. That is on billboards. Billboards has been a fantastic way of mass marketing. Apple uses it quite often. If you've got the money and if you want to market in front of a huge audience, go ahead, use billboards. Number 12 is magazines and newspapers. There are still a bunch of people who do read newspapers and magazines. Honestly, I am, I don't remember when is the last time I had read newspaper or even a magazine. It's been a long, long time for sure. But yeah, if you have got a product or service which caters to the audience who do read newspapers and magazines, that is the way to go for you. And finally, number 13 is one of my favorite ones. It is cross-platform ads. So what do I mean by that is let's say you are a pet shop owner, you sell pet food, you sell leashes, you sell, you know, dog beds and whatnot. What you would do is you would go to another cross platform, which is pretty much parallel to what you do. It could be a veterinary doctor, a pet doctor, and you would tie up with her and you would say, Hey, you know what, please give this 10% coupons to every customer of yours, every dog or every cat that comes to you. And what do you get if you give out these hundred of them? I'm going to give you hundred dollars. So she gives hundred coupons for you. And in turn, you get customers from her indirectly a referral from her to you. Another option could be something like, let's say you are a, a fruit seller. You sell fruits, fresh fruits, organic fruits, and whatever. Maybe you refer a milkman, somebody who sells milk, organic milk, good quality, this, that, whatever you guys tie up together. And then maybe come up with a cross platform thing. You know, he sells a different service. You sell a different service. You guys work together, promote each other and advertise for each other, helping both of you in turn, increase, improve and better your business, make more money and create an impact together. These are 13 ways you can market now. I'm also going to put them in the description below and I'll see you very soon until then. Bye-bye.